Hey everyone, it's John here. And in this video, we're gonna take a look at the new copy to clipboard feature in Microsoft Flow. So this is gonna allow us to copy actions inside of a flow and also copy actions from one flow to another. So let's take a look at this. I've got a flow here and here's one of my actions. I've got a populate Microsoft Word template action and it's all filled in. And if I wanna copy this, I can now go up to the three dot menu here and click on that. And you can see that we can copy to my clipboard. So let's click on that. And now to use this, we can create a new action. So let's add an action. And we have this new option here. So we have my clipboard. And if we click on that, then that's going to show us all the things that we've copied into our clipboard. Here you can see my populate Microsoft Word template action. And if I click on that, then I get a copy of that action. So here we can see that I've got those two actions. They're the exact same. One's just a copy of the other one. Now you can also copy multiple actions at the same time. So instead of going to each action and copying it from this menu, what we can do is add a scope action. Let's add that in. And then we can add any actions that we wanna create a copy of into this scope. So let's add a couple in there. And now if we copy the scope action, and let's go and add another action and add that back in. We can go to our clipboard and paste in our scope action. And you can see that we've got those three actions inside our scope. So that might save some time if you need to copy a lot of different actions. Now we can also copy these from our clipboard from one flow into another flow. So let's head over to another flow and check that out. Let's go and edit this flow here. And let's add a new step. And again, let's just paste in from our clipboard. And there's our two things we copied from our, in our clipboard and available in our other flows. So here's our three actions inside our scope copied into our new or different flow. Now, another thing we can do with this, if we copy this action here, we can actually go over to any text editor and if we press control V, that's gonna paste in the code from the action that we just copied. And this might be a little bit unreadable. So what we can do is go to uh, this website here, jsonformatter.org, and we can paste that in there and we can see a nicely formatted version of that code. Now, if you're up to it, you can actually edit this code so for example, the action I copied had my email address as the to recipient in the email action. We can edit this. And if we copy our new code that's been edited, we can actually go back to flow and inside our clipboard, we can actually press control V and paste that code into our clipboard. So let's take a look at this. And you can see that here's the email address that I edited instead of what I copied from, which had this email address here. So that can be a pretty quick and easy way to quickly share something between tenants. Now let's head back to the clipboard. And if you've got items in your clipboard already and you wanna see the code for those, you can use this information icon right here. And if you hover over it, that's gonna show you the code. And if you're careful and also lucky, you can copy and paste that code. So it can be a little bit tricky as it tends to disappear when you 
move outside of that area. But we can copy that and then paste it into a text editor and edit it and then paste back the edited version if we want to. And lastly, if you want to clear out this clipboard, what you're going to have to do is sign out of Microsoft Flow. And when you sign back in, the clipboard will be emptied. So that's the new copy to clipboard feature in Microsoft Flow. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you hit the thumbs up button and subscribe to the channel. That's it for this video. See you in the next one.